Today I will make a demonstration of the effects of magnetism on high voltage arcs. For that I have this neodymium magnet and I will generate a high voltage arc on top of the magnet. I will use AC arcs and also DC arcs. I have this glass plate on top of the magnet because the neodymium magnet is a conductor of electricity and the glass is to avoid the electric current to pass through the magnet. I want the arc to be only at top of the magnet to see the effects of magnetism only. First I will use DC high voltage using this high voltage power supply that I made using a TV flyback. It generates around 10,000 volts DC. Let's now try with AC. I am using this high voltage transformer that I took from a photocopier machine and it generates 10,000 volts at 60 Hz. As we just saw, in the presence of the magnet, the high voltage arc has this form, like it moves away from the magnet. And the reason for this is that the arc is an electric current. And in the presence of a magnetic field, electric currents feel a force known as the Lorentz force and that force depends on the magnitude and direction of both the current and the magnetic field generated by the magnet. Okay, that was for a DC high voltage arc. When we used AC, we saw that the high voltage arc spreads through the magnet. And the reason for that is that since we are using AC, the direction of the electric current changes, in this case, 60 times per second. So, at one point in time, the force tries to move the arc upwards, and then, when the direction of the electric current changes, it moves in the other way. Since this happens very rapidly, at 60 Hz, the effect is that we see the arc spread through the magnet. Let's now try the experiment again, but passing the high voltage arc through this flash tube. I will try first with AC. And now let's try with DC.
Thanks for visiting my channel. I hope you liked this high voltage experiment.